Texas Tech Athletics made it official today as the 19th men's basketball head coach Grant McCaslin was welcomed here at the United Supermarkets Arena and it's a full circle moment for McCaslin because he started his coaching career a little under 25 years ago right here at Texas Tech as the director of operations. This is McCaslin's fifth head coaching job but he's no stranger to West Texas. He got his first head coaching job at Midland College and in 2007 he led that junior college to win a national championship. Then he spent two years at Midwest State University in 2009 to 11. Then McCausen made the jump to D1 and was an assistant coach at Baylor University from 2011 to 2016. McCausen then went to Arkansas State and was the head coach there from 2016 to 2017. Then McCausen made his way back to Texas and for the last six years he was the head coach at the University of North Texas. And most recently, McCaslin led the Mean Green to an NIT championship game this past season, and UNT went on to win it all. He's been all over Texas and even in Arkansas, but it seems like there's something about West Texas that's brought McCaslin back. When you look back at the journey, it's pretty remarkable. I mean, a lot of things pointed to this place that are beautiful that you can't really explain. It became an opportunity. I, I, everyone has an opinion on, on Lubbock. I love Lubbock. Like, this is like where my wife and I met, and it's where we want to be with all our heart. It, it is amazing the timing that God's timing is, and so I do feel like this is the right time. It's not just home to Grant McCasland, though. Cece, his wife, was a Red Raider soccer player in her time here in Lubbock, and his grandfather was also on the Texas Tech football team. McCasland even said today that his dad was at all of his practices for the last six years. So I'm sure we will be seeing a lot of the McCasland family at all of the events here at Texas Tech. Signing off from the United Supermarkets Arena, I'm Faith Douglas.